Hey guys, I am Dev back with another Affinity Photo tutorial video. Today I will show you how to create a realistic face swap in Affinity Photo. Now to create a realistic face swap, I would suggest you to use your source image like this, image that have a straight face towards the screen. If you use this type of font face straight looking image, then your final output really comes very natural and realistic. However, for fun, you can use any type of images. Anyway, at first, open your project image. I am using here Margot Robbie and Angelina Jolie. We do not need much more about them. We all know they are Hollywood celebrities and photo credit goes to Google search. At first, we need to select only face by using free hand selection tool. Click on it. And draw a selection around the face like this. Now go to top, click refine, we need to make soften on our selection edges. Increase feather sliders. Then apply. Now copy or cut this selection by Ctrl C copy or Ctrl X cut. Go to next image and press Ctrl V paste. Use move tool and try to match with the current face like this just for now decrease opacity and try to match with the current face like this eye to eye nose to nose lip to lip take your time resize or reposition it Now we need to match the skin color tone. Go to right side below, adjustment, HSL. We just need to match the color of this cutting face only with below image. So click and hold adjustment and put it on a face image and move it right side to clip with this image. Now just adjust this hue shift slider slightly. Now this is an optional as here Angelina face little bit outside from the below face. So add a mask. Select paint brush tool. Foreground color black, hardness 0 and now brush on that area. That's cool, right? Please leave your comment, hit like and subscribe this channel. This small act motivates me to do more cool videos like this. Now few small adjustments using levels just a little bit. Add vibrance. Now select all layers and Ctrl G make a group folder. Now Ctrl plus Shift plus Alt plus E snapshot. Go to top filters, sharpen, unsharp mask. just a little bit my radius around 3% and 
and that's it this is my final output hope you like this work comment down below this video So here Margot Robbie and now Angelina Jolie. I hope you find this video helpful. If you like my work with Affinity series then subscribe this YouTube channel to get more amazing Affinity Photo effect tutorials. You can support me on my Instagram account link in video description and also you can check out the other videos in channel playlist. Thanks for watching and I will back with another video soon. Till then, keep practicing and have fun with Affinity Photo.